Hello guys, Mr. GB Games here, and welcome back to another Minecraft mining video. Uh, I know I was working on the series of um, making a mob, but instead of that video, today we'll do a little bit different video, and today we're going to make an X-ray block, which actually is really, really easy. Now, we usually start with the public static, uh, let's start that correctly, static final block, uh, x-ray block, we'll call it, um, not c-ray block, so x-ray block equals new tutorial block 1003, like that. Now, while we just use the tutorial block that we as well use in um, our first real mining video where we made our first block um, is because an x-ray block is just a normal block. It could be a block with any kind of um, basically what, whatever code is inside of the block where I have for special abilities it has. You can still run this. So we'll do material dot okay uh, glass I think is a good one. Okay. Um, set unlocalized name x ray block. Um, and then we'll do game registry, oops, three dot register block, uh, x ray block, like that. Within capital R. There we go. And uh, has proxy names, but we'll just add it here. Mo oops, mo loader dot add name um, x ray block x ray block. Okay, so now we've set uh, the block. The um, this is just a normal block. If we boot up the game now, um, actually we should put it into a creative tab. Uh, dot set creative. Oops, creative tab. Create creative tabs. Dot tab block. There you go. Um, so now it will just appear as a textureless block. Um, but that is where the main part goes in. Now, this is... Okay, I was working on thumbnail. <laughs> but you will create a 16 by 16 uh, texture, obviously. And we get this. And what you do is you need paint on that. Uh, link in the description if you want to download that and don't yet have it. Now, just empty everything out so the background is like this. Doing that by Ctrl A and then delete. Um, now you can create anything you would like it to look like. So for instance, I would like it to have little white blobs around so it has somewhat of an appearance Oops. Um, in the world. So basically every pixel you do not color here is a pixel that will be seeable through into the world. Uh, and I will show the result in just a second. So now you have this uh, kind of thing. I'm going to add a little bit more to it to look a little oops, a little nicer um, like this. So basically it's really hard to see. Uh, well, what we're going to do it a little bit easier. So everything I color black now is what will be seeable through in the end result. So uh, everything that's white will be the block and everything that's black now will be seeable through. Now what I did is basically um, I you could uh, as well do this, select the areas that are now black and delete them and now they're seeable through. Now if I save this to my desktop um, and I'll call it x-ray block well it needs to be the same as the unlocalized name so we'll have a quick look at what that was the unlocalized name was x-ray block okay and the ID with the crack cap rules and the x-ray block okay save that now we'll open up and um, explore a window go to desktop X. For some reason, it's not there yet. 
a quick look. Um, it's not there. What? what? Um, obviously. Okay, so now it's there. We'll control C this. Um, and go to P from programming where it is. Uh, there we go. Modding 1.5.1. Yes, we're still 1.5.1, but all the things I do right now will work in 1.5.2, guaranteed. So, never mind. Don't care about it. It will work. Um, MCP, SRC, Minecraft, textures, blocks. Paste it in. Now, um, a normal ore would have the same properties, and in the next video, well, not in the next video, but in some video, I will show you how to create a custom gloss texture which will be seeable through but won't have the x-ray thing which I will show as I said in a future video but as well you can see how fast this went um, it could have been faster if I didn't explain anything so it's really easy to do the only main thing you need to focus on is the textures and how you do them uh, and further than that it's just a normal block it doesn't have any special properties in the block file and that is really quite cool I don't know why I sized that up because it's not going to work correctly um, but yeah, now we're going to jump right into Minecraft. See. Okay, so we're in Minecraft right now. Let's go ahead and go to Ore Test, which is, um, I think underneath the ground, which isn't great for what we're going to, oh no, it actually isn't. Um, so let's go to Blocks, and as you can see, here's our X-ray block, which looks like a normal glass block that's seeable through, as you can see. If we place it, there you go, you can actually see cave systems which is really cool in my opinion and yes you can see through x-ray blocks as well as you can see there. Uh, so that is how to create an x-ray block it's not especially hard but not many people seem to know it so it's something quite fun and uh so this is how to create an x-ray block I hope you like this video if you did you could give it a thumbs up or subscribe and as you can see that is the way down we used in the or making and generation video so once again thank you guys for watching see you guys next time bye